Yo, what's good, buddies? Welcome back. My name is Beaker. You guys probably know that by now. So today, we're going to be doing some war. We're in the Ruthless 50, my Town Hall 9 clan. And uh, we're looking at a pretty close war here. This was fun. This was fun, man. So as you can see, first of all, Snippy 3 star me. What, what's good, Snippy? What's good? Let's check out Snippy's raid, see what he did. I think he did a pretty nice 3-star attack. When I say 3-star attack, I, of course, mean, like, a good 3-star army. Yes! Yes, he has hogs. I love it. So many people just try to three star me with go wipe and it's like, ah, uh, and sometimes they do because my base is terrible. Now, when you look at my base, you might be like, what? That's not terrible. Well, I don't have expos <laughs> and it kind of makes it pretty weak. You'll see why in a minute. This guy is starting out with four golems and that is going to crush my base because I don't have expos. That is that difference in damage is going to make such a difference in this case because he has so many hit points in those golems what's good golems like like they're getting shot at but nothing's happening like they're <laughs> ah somebody kill those golems no nobody's gonna kill those golems so his heroes his wizards nobody is even touching them they're just cruising through the base you a snippy what's up snippy he knows what's up he knows four golems is gonna crush me so look at this queen why, 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 why did my queen not do anything? Does anybody know? That was dumb. That was really dumb. Like, his queen's shooting mine, my queen does nothing. Anyway, Snippy, it's like you, it's like you use like some mind control techniques on my queen or something. Anyway, um, cool, I'm over it, I'm over it. Now his hogs are going in, in the perfect spot there. He sent them in in the danger zone. I call it the danger zone because there's all these Teslas there and a bunch of other defenses. And normally people just get crushed there. But he started in the danger zone and now he's all good. So he's going up here and there are some bombs up in this area. Watch this. That one wizard helped out a lot. It took out that air sweeper and then the hogs were able to go up instead of right into the bombs there. Oh, Sniffy, dude. You're a lucky man, Sniffy. So here he is. I got a couple of spring traps right there, but again, you're a lucky man, Sniffy. I actually think all of my spring traps are right there and he only hit two. What? <laughs> he did it, man. He did it. Like, I, I was pretty stoked on this. Pretty stoked to watch this. Four Golem Goho. Must say, I've only tried it a couple of times. And really, against really strong bases, sometimes it doesn't work because you don't have enough hogs. I think using three Golems is plenty. But in this case, look at this. Look at this. He still has two. That's two Golems, right? I think they're like... <laughs> yeah, they're like best buddies on top of each other. Or more whatever uh yeah look they're like full health or half health or whatever health they are they're still alive so if your base can't kill a golem at all <laughs> you've got issues and i do i know that anyway snippy good job buddy <laughs> good job snippy so the the moral of the story is today snippy three starred me so we're gonna go try to three star him that's that's the rule right let's go Yo, know, how funny is this? Like, we're basically the same level, same rank, okay? He's 13, I'm 14. But look at his base. It's totally different. It's way lower level than mine. And I think it's mostly because of the Expos, you know? It has to do with my whole clan. Like, the person across from you isn't always going to be exactly like you. But this is nothing like my base. Anyway, that's how it goes, man. That's what it's like to be a Town Hall 0.5, you know, a Town Hall 8.5 or 9.5. Anyway, uh, what are we doing over here? We got a queen walk, nice. His archer tower, his expo, they're kind of low level. So that's good in this situation. We're just going to wreck this. It, this is going to be such a fun raid. We're going to walk all the way over into this corner here where there's this little like pocket alleyway, uh, valley, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. We're going to walk right in it with the king, the queen, and a golem and some wizards. It's going to be fun. Look at where the king is right there. He's right next to two air defense. So if we can take out two air defense and both of the heroes, it's going to be an easy raid. Remember that, guys. When you look at a base and you're wondering, should I use air? Should I use hogs? What should I use? If you can take out two of the air defense, you should use air. Yeah. Of course, you have to also take out the enemy queen and possibly the clan castle troops and possibly an air sweeper. But you, you get what I mean. You guys get what I mean. So here we go. We're getting here. And the golem is up front distracting enemy king. And my king is hitting his king. It's like this weird ugh, thing. My queen is over here. What What are you doing? Nothing. Cool. And now everybody's getting into the middle. And this is the second air defense. 
that's the second one right there. So after that, we have taken out so much of the space. Beautiful. So now we're going over here with the air troops. We got a couple of hounds already dropped. This section didn't work so well. Looks like we dropped a, a couple of balloons without protection that kind of died. But the main group here is looking sick. Look, they got a hound in front of them, balloons behind, looking good. And really, if you take out two air defense at the beginning of the raid, you can have a sloppy raid. <laughs> you can drop your balloons wherever and like be totally stupid and still get the three. Case in point, Beaker's Lab. Here we go. <laughs> Getting the final few defenses. That wizard tower, it's beautiful. It's so low level. Like it's not, it's not even doing anything. Yes. All right. So, you know, kind of a lower level base, but still a really fun one. I usually don't do queen walk with air here on my town online account because, you know, it's tricky and you can run out of time, but it worked beautifully here. This was a great base to try it out on. Boom. There it is. Snippy. How's it going, buddy? Wherever you are. Nice, nice face off. <laughs> Me and Snippy having a face off. Woo. Anyway, uh, I think we got time for one more video today. Why don't we go look and, and see if we can find a nice three star. Let's go. One minute left of war. This, I forgot this dude. This won the war right here. Let's check this out. Leahy, what's good? I was actually gonna attack this base and I didn't because I'm stupid. I totally forgot and I, I, I'm sorry to my clan. But anyway, Leahy is gonna pick it up right here. This is gonna be sick. When are you going to start, Leahy? Here, here he goes, right here. Golems are down. Wizards on the sides. Oh, they're getting shot. No. Okay, they're okay. Now he's just clearing some buildings on the outside, getting everything set up here. Poison goes down to kill... Homie had archers? <laughs> Sometimes people want archers in their clan castle. And I get it, but I wouldn't do it. Anyway, uh, here we go. Getting in here. Took out one bomb already. Beautiful. Couple of Valks go in. They can get right in this little channel here. And yeah, there's some bombs in there, but it led right into the queen. That was cool. Now they're in there. Is he going to drop a jump? I think he did. I just can't see it because there's so many spells right there and it's on. Let's go. So dropping hogs on each defense here. That Tesla is wrecking. So is that one. He drops a heal. Perfect. Perfect. Now the Valks are already down in here with the hogs. This is incredible. Look at how well this is going. The queen is up top doing some stuff on her own. The Valks are running with the hogs here through this whole channel. This is sick. This is crazy. And there's a bomb going to take out a lot of these troops. He had another heal. Wow. I don't know if he meant to run down that whole channel there, but he did with the Valks and it worked so well. And there's the final defense. Look at that, dude. So many hogs left. And then he he dropped the quake just for style points. Love it. Love it. Wow. Last minute win from Leahy. I don't know. I don't know what the score was before this raid, but I know after this raid, we won by one star. So this did it, man. This did it right here. So good job to Leahy. Boom. Beaker, you did not do so well. <laughs> I had that one three star, but that was it. And uh, yeah. Sorry, buddies. Anyway, uh, that's going to be it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed this little war recap. I had fun. I especially enjoyed Leahy's raid. That was sick, man. Only uh, six Valks. Six Valks, but they wrecked. They really wrecked. So, anyways, guys, I'll see you next time. Peace.